Welcome back. Now, former India captain and ex-chairman of selectors, uh, Dilip Vengsarkar, is miffed with BCCI President Saurav Ganguly on how he handled Virat Kohli Captain C. Rao. In fact, in the straight attack, Vengsarkar has said that as BCCI chief, Ganguly had no business to speak on the behalf of the selectors on the Kohli captaincy issue and it should have been Chetan Chauhan, the chief selector of the team, who should clarify. In fact, Ben Sarkar also, while referring uh, to the statement uh, given by Ganguly, where he had said that BCCI had tried to convince Virat Kohli not to leave the T20 captaincy, a claim that was uh, rebutted by Virat later himself. I completely uh, back uh, Dilip on this issue, actually. Uh, Dilip, sir, uh, what he's saying is absolutely true. Uh, Saurav, instead of Saurav Ganguly, it would have been better if the chief selector, Chetan Sharma, was allowed to talk and he had spoken on this issue, you know, uh, because it is the chief selector, ultimately, who takes a call, who would have taken a call, I believe, uh, to, to, to sack Virat uh, from the ODI uh, captaincy, you know. So, so, so this is something that the chief selector should have been allowed to explain. I don't know why the chief selector is not being allowed to talk in this regime. Uh, you know, uh, neither was Mr. Sunil Joshi, who was the previous chief selector, allowed to talk. Neither is uh, Chetan Sharma allowed to talk. The only press conference that he, he's uh, spoken in uh, has been the, in the one after the T20 World Cup selection. Uh, so, so, so there's a gaping hole there that the BCCI needs to fill. Uh, you know, there's a uh, clearly a case of accountability and transparency with which the BCCI seems to be lacking in there. Uh, and the and, and the BCCI president talking about these issues uh, is slightly uh, you know misfit there. Uh, having said that, Saurav Ganguly is not somebody who's just another uh, BCCI president. He's not a, unlike a Mr. Shinivasan or a Mr. Dalmia or a Mr. Sharad Pawar. He's somebody who's a former India captain, who's played the sport, who's played, uh, you know, more than 100 test matches. Uh, so, so, so he has a fair idea. Uh, to uh, about, about these things about captaincy and stuff so uh, you know he i can understand his his keenness to comment on these issues uh, you know uh, so so he's not entirely wrong, wrong also sort of there but then uh, he should refrain being in the chair that he is he should refrain from commenting on these issues and leave it to the chief selector to talk about it